Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to do a recap of some of the best timesheet apps out there on the market. All right, so let's get right into this. As I said, we're gonna be taking a look at some of the best timesheet apps available on the market. Now in this video, I'm gonna be covering five different apps, but if you're looking for an even longer list, I will have a link right down below in the video description to our blog, so feel free to check that out. Now then, the first app on our list is of course Hubstaff, and honestly, timesheets aren't something we've shown in detail here on the channel. So here's a quick look at how they work. If your team is tracking time with Hubstaff, timesheets will be created automatically. You can customize your layout here by day or week, or you can structure everything with different columns like activity, idle time, you name it. Then you can quickly enable timesheet approvals by selecting team members and assigning them pay periods. Once approvals are enabled, those team members will receive email notifications reminding them to submit their timesheets. And managers will be notified whenever timesheets are submitted and ready for approval. If there are any concerns over the hours submitted, the timesheet can be denied and sent back for adjustments. While approved timesheets can quickly be paid. And the last thing to note with timesheets in Hubstaff is you can create and export very detailed reports that allow you to see exactly where time is being spent and how much each project is costing. And in addition to these timesheet features, you also have access to things like scheduling, geofences, a wide variety of third-party integrations, and much more. As far as pricing goes, you have four plans to choose from, and which plan you choose will really depend on the size of your team. First, we have the free plan, which is ideal for freelancers, the basic plan, which starts at $7 a user per month, the premium plan, starting at $10 a user per month, and the enterprise plan, which is $20 a user per month. If you would like a more detailed breakdown of the different plans Hubstaff offers, I'll have a link down below in the video description, as well as here on the video screen in one of the top corners here. I'm not sure which one, but it'll be up there. Next, we have Beeble Timesheet, which is another web-based app that helps business owners and managers understand how employees are using their time throughout the workday. And as you gather information, you can analyze that data with Google or Microsoft Office tools. You can also create custom reports to view in the app or export to another program. Beeble will also allow you to track attendance across your entire team. And here's what we would consider to be the four key features of Beeble. General time tracking, employee attendance and absence tracking, timesheets, and timesheet reports. And finally, let's take a quick look at pricing. So Beeble timesheet has one plan, and that comes in at $6.97 a user per month. Third, we have timesheets.com, which allows for both manual and automatic time tracking. Their primary focus is definitely software teams, but their tools still work well for both in-office and remote teams. In addition to the usual time and attendance tracking you'd expect from a timesheet app, you'll also have access to mileage and expenses. However, as far as platforms go, they are limited to browser-based tracking on both desktop and mobile. As for a recap on this app's key features, we have general time tracking, time off and PTO management, mileage and expense tracking, and reporting. For pricing, Timesheets offers three different plans. Their freelancer plan, which is free, a standard plan, which is $4.50 a user per month, and a nonprofit plan, which is $3.60 a user per month. So as you can see, this option is easily one of the most affordable on the list. However, I do think that in exchange for it being so cost effective, you are getting what I would consider to be a rather dated interface. This option also provides you with minimal integrations, so it might be difficult to incorporate this tool into your existing workflow. Moving on to the fourth app on our list, we have Timesheet Express, which is a straightforward time tracking system that works for most businesses. Your employees enter their time and you approve it. Simple as that. Now, as straightforward as that is, it might be a drawback as well, because there are other options on this list that don't require your employees to manually enter anything at all, meaning there are automated features on the other apps that you might benefit from. 
Another thing to take note of here is the reporting capabilities. If you want more advanced tracking and reporting features, Timesheet Express might be a little light for you. But as I said, if you're looking for something that's simple and easy for everyone on your team to use, this could be a very solid choice. Now, before we move on, here is a quick recap of the features this option would provide you with. We have timesheets, time tracking, employee attendance tracking, project budgeting, and minimal reporting capabilities. When it comes to pricing, this is definitely an area where Timesheet Express separates itself from other options on the list. You can purchase the software for a one-time fee of $95.59, and that does include unlimited usage and 12 months of email support and upgrades. And closing out the video with the fifth and final option on our list, we have ClickTime, which does offer a downloadable desktop app similar to Hubstaff, and that means you'll have access to what your team is working on and more precise project budgeting. Of course, you can also use it for timesheet management and attendance tracking. As for a roundup on this app's key features, we have general time tracking, time off management, overtime management, expense tracking, project budgeting, and solid reporting capabilities. As far as pricing goes, ClickTime offers four different plans to choose from. First, we have their starter plan, which is $9 a user per month, the team plan, which is $12 a user per month, the premier plan coming in at $24 a user per month, and the enterprise plan, which requires a custom quote. So more flexibility here in comparison to Timesheets or Timesheet Express, but one other thing I did notice was their desktop interface is still a little bit dated. especially in comparison to the mobile app, which does look more modern. However, there might be plans in the future to align the two better so the user experience is more consistent. And there you have it. There's five of the best timesheet apps available. If you found this video helpful, feel free to hit that thumbs up right down below. And if you are new here, consider subscribing to the channel so you're notified of any future video uploads. And if you do wanna see that longer list, again, I will have a link right down below in the video description, so feel free to check that out. And as always, thank you so much for watching, and we'll talk to you soon.